the bells, sweet silver bells, all sing to say, throw cares away, Christmas is here. Today I'm doing my Black Friday haul, and I bought clothes from a lot of different places and different sites or whatever, so you guys, if you want to see what I got, stay tuned. Right before we get into the video, you guys, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit the red button. And don't forget to turn on your notification bell so you can see everything that's going on with my channel in the latest video whenever I post them. And also, if you don't mind, go ahead and give me a big thumbs up and let's get on to the video. First couple things that I bought that came from Forever 21, um, they had a great sale. And some things I was shocked to see that they had to sell on. Once I went up to purchase my item, they were marked down like drastically. So this is the first thing I bought. It's a skirt. It has like that 70s look to it. And it also has suspenders or scraps or whatever you want to call it on top. And I think this is so cute. It's something that you can wear to church or something like that. Or I don't know, wherever you want to wear it to. I just thought it was cute. And the next item I bought were some high waist pants. And you guys can't see how these really look until I try them on. I tried them on so you guys can get a good look at them. But they're wide all the way down. And they also have like suspenders on them and a belt around the waist part. Um, I think all these clothes are very retro. They're very, very cute. And this one was $32.90, but with the sale, it was only $9.99. Yes, I was very shocked when I got this one. I thought that they were very, very cute. This shirt from Forever 21 as well. It's like a shirt that I'm gonna wear up under both of the jumpers. I thought that it would be perfect for them. Um, a shirt that was served multiple purposes for my jumpsuits and for whatever. Um, I guess it has like a, I don't wanna say retro, but it's like a Three Musketeers look and it ties in the front. And I bought these pants from Forever 21. They are high waist and they are wide all the way down the bottom. They have a black stripe going down the side, which you really can't see unless you see it in person, and a black stripe going around the rim. I thought these were so, so cute. They are a size small and they are like a silk material, very thin material. They look really, really cute. And I'll be wearing it with my Three Musketeers shirt as well. Next, I got just two pair of jeans. I ordered these offline. I got them from American Eagle. I actually went into the store and I tried them on and they didn't have the size that I wanted, but I still wanted to see how they fit before I bought them. And I thought they were cute. These jeans, they're actually a size six and they're long and high rise because I like for my jeans to fit long. I really like them to fit longer than shorter. And they are a pair of the mom jeans but these are cute, they're just a normal wash jean, no holes or anything in them. They fit cute. And here are another pair of mom jeans, and I also got these in a size six, and they are long as well, and they are high rise, and they actually are a lighter wash jean, and they have holes in them. They are distressed jeans, and on the back, they have like this little distressed part. These are cute as well. And I got a guest sweatshirt. It's just nothing special about it really. It's just a pink sweatshirt with the guest symbol on the front or the logo. And this one, I really just like the color. Next, I got another guest shirt. It also has guest Los Angeles on there with the guest symbol. This one right here, I got in a small. And I got it from the men's section because I really like this, this sweatshirt and I still want it to fit kind of baggy. Even though I got it in a size small, I don't ever go all the way up to medium, medium or anything like that because I think that's just too baggy for me. Um, but this one fits perfectly. Now I also got this guest shirt. Um, it's just a plain white t-shirt with the red trim and guest Los Angeles on it. And I had got this one from the men's section as well because I wanted a small, but I wanted to seal that baggy fit. Um, to give it that kind of 90s look. I know in the guest store, once you spent like over $100, they gave you a free water bottle. So I probably would be putting this into my husband's stocking. Or I might keep it myself, I don't know. It is a little water bottle with an infusion thing inside. Okay, next I got another guest shirt and I ordered this one from Urban Outfitters. 
Um, I ordered this one from the men's section as well. I like the color scheme of it. And I thought about wearing it with some like black jeans or something like that. But then once I got the shirt, I really don't too much care for it. Like once I tried it on. So I'm still trying to decide, should I keep it or should I return it? You guys comment down below, let me know what should I do. Almost, I got that one. And the next place I ordered from was Urban Outfitters. I got a champion shirt. It's just a plain white t-shirt with long sleeves with the champion logo on the sleeve. And this shirt, this shirt or 24, I think it was, I paid $24 for this shirt. And I don't know what, if it was the original price or whatever. I can't remember if they, if I got the sale, but I thought I just wanted the t-shirt. And also I found this t-shirt in the men's section. Next, I got a coat from Macy's. Um, this coat was originally like 100 and I don't know, I took the, I've already taken out the tag because I've worn it before, but I paid $44 for it. It's like one of those fuzzy coats and I thought it was really cute and I love the color and it has buttons on the downside. It's almost like a pea coat, but with the fuzzy material. So I guess that's what you could call it, a pea coat. And it has nice pockets on the side and also it has a inside. It also has an inside pocket. And I thought it was very cute. And most of the time when I buy my coats, I buy them during this time because they are a lot cheaper. I got another coat. I got this coat from Charlotte Russe. I really don't like to buy like too many things from there because with my experience from Charlotte Russe, some of the clothes are um, not as good of quality. I guess if you're going like with uh, like a certain trend that you know you won't wear for a while, by all means, I would say go in there and purchase that. It stops like right at the waist and it has a big collar. I thought this was really cute and I like the color as well. And I think this one was $44 to in Charlotte Roots and I got it on sale. It was $20 once I paid for it. So this is it for the video without me rambling on. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys in the next one.